Good evening everyone. This is Slinky here with the automatic chicken coop door opener closer project. It's an ongoing project. Uh, I'm just to the point where I have a functioning door. And I haven't yet added the Wi-Fi to it, uh, but that'll be coming soon. But I want to show you where we're at with the, uh, the door functionality. And uh, for starters, we've got an old uh, Black & Decker cordless drill that I picked up from uh, Goodwill for $5. So that was quite a score. And you can see the battery uh, compartment makes a perfect fit for the Cijuino that's inside right there. And uh, in fact, it's oriented right there. You can see the, uh, uh, the USB cable coming out of there. And the USB is just for uh, debugging, monitoring, and programming, etc. Get it on uh, macro mode here and uh, get in close with that. So that fits in there. And that also is going to house the, um, the Black Widow board. So those two are going to stack pretty well inside that battery compartment. The Black Widow board is the uh, Wi Fi component. And uh, I've got a web page set up right here that I can click the button on. And get a mouse here and click the button and turn the LEDs on and then off. So I've got the Wi Fi happening right there. So this is serving up that web page right there and it allows me to turn the uh, LEDs on and off. So that's going to allow me to send the motor commands, monitor temperatures and light conditions to uh, open the door automatically. Until I get that installed, uh, we're going to go with just time of day. Let me get uh, some focus for you there. And the moment you've been waiting for the operation of it. Now you can see the uh, anti-raccoon latch release down there. Here we go. And then uh, it stopped by the micro switch right there. Now you'll notice the speed is different going up. Oh, and a misfire. Yeah, that's, that's due to the debounce logic that's uh, going to be added here shortly. That was me double hitting the switch uh, prior to that. But now it's going up and down pretty smoothly. I do have a little bit of filing to do on some edges to make it uh, go smoother. But if you don't use this mechanism to open the door as you can see it's not going anywhere so hopefully the raccoons won't be able to get in there let's see we've got uh, some details here we've got uh, an old solder spool right here uh, just some bolts that had been found um, I was going to put a counterweight on it but uh, the motor seems to be plenty strong to haul the door up uh, even though it it weighs probably about as much as this uh, 6 volt 7 amp hour battery does right here. And that will be charged uh, via a little solar panel um, that I, I don't have right here. And uh, Velcro, I love this stuff. Scored a roll of uh, black hook and loop from uh, Harbor Freight today for about 8 bucks. It's really useful stuff. And uh, let's see, what other things? Oh yeah, I had to whittle the plastic off of this uh, USB connector right here to get it to fit properly between the ribs um, in there but it fits pretty nicely I think I'll be able to seal that maybe with Sugru if they ever uh, get it to market wouldn't that be nice but uh, this is this is it in, uh, in a nutshell thanks for tuning in and uh, let me show it to you in operation here a couple more times Alright everyone, have a great evening.